Yeah, the only way to get like better metals usually, uh, especially. Yeah, on it looks easy, like you get everything. You have to. Well, there's there's bonus objectives and stuff. There's also like the skull system where you make things harder on yourself. Yeah, you get bonus score. So basically, you got to be fast. You got to get all the objectives, and then you can also turn on skulls and shit to make silver is basically the best you can get on easy. I don't know. Legitimately. James Cutter, captain of the Spirit of Fire. We're supposed to be lost with all hands. Not so lost, it seems. What happened down there? I need to know what we're up against. Isabel? Why is AI always such a Isabel, dick? Isabel, report. Sir. Five months ago, the portal from the Ark to Earth shut down without warning. A month later, he arrived. He? Oh, this is like the trailer for the game right here. The brute. <laughs> yeah. Their leader. His name was Isabel. She looks like a little fairy. Isabel. 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 Oh, what is up with white screens? During the war, the Covenant used his clan as expendable muscle. Told them dying in battle would <laughs> this is legitimately the trailer. <laughs> yeah, this whole cutscene is going to be what the trailer was. No monetization. Game to fucking pop up. He killed a panther with his bare hands. And they tried to banish him. And everything we know about the Covenant's thousand year history. Atriox was the first to defy the Covenant and survive. Did he rip off the dude's head? Well, they have helmets too. Apparently, these guys have a helmet fetish. <laughs> Boink. It's totally 300. It's even ramping. Yeah. Three hundred. Yeah, 300 would have made for a great Halo Wars game. Or just a great game, period. I would have loved the 300 game back in the day. It's about when I played it because I didn't have a system at that point. <laughs> Dude, those are legit looking. <laughs> These videos have been like 50% full motion videos so far. <laughs> right. 50% CGI video cutscenes. Nah, that doesn't make for a good video game. And an old one at that. But here we are. Thirty years past what anyone could ask of us. Our war is gone. The lives we have are gone. Today is our Independence Day. <laughs> I was thinking the same thing. When's Bill Polian coming? And now, all that we may have left. He said duty. 
after battle, fighting side by side, together. Where you see half a crew is I see family, <laughs> courage, and a thousand heroes who swore to fight their way through hell before they ever, ever turn their backs and run. And where you see one old... Child, she, like, what are you, are you talking to me right now? I'm totally faded. It'd be funny if she just, like, <laughs> she turned just, off. <laughs> she's like, I, I was totally, like... <laughs> Wondering if there's a way off this shit. <laughs> like, can you put my chip in like a missile and just launch me towards the nearest fucking Earth planet? I mean, seriously, I don't need to be here for this, right? This is totally like a United States thing. It's like there's a civil war going on. We need to interject ourselves in the middle of it. Well, uh, that's not exactly what's going on. These guys are. N done with their civil war part. This is just a group of motherfuckers at this point. The Grod? The, the, the Covenant is fucking done with at this point. Uh oh. Okay. These motherfuckers are a whole different set of people. They're not fighting with anybody. So we're just unnecessarily going and attacking them. <laughs> no, they are fucking terrorizing this whole area. Decimus, he's one of Atriox's chief lieutenants and the one who led the attack on my outpost. He oversees a banished salvage operation near the outpost. We need to hit the banished with a surprise attack to put them on their back foot, then move south and establish an HQ. Ah, Once we have a base building, that should be fun. Listen up, team. The banished are dug in deep. And dead set on controlling this installation, and we cannot allow that to happen. Strike one. Your job is to establish a most of the improvements to the engine, like most of the things that make it look better, uh -huh. are animation, like details, just like the thickness of all the trees and everything, right? And everything moving. So, I'm really liking this so far. But I almost wish this story was a an actual Halo game. <laughs> this yeah. story seems better than... I'm going to be disappointed if we actually kill this fucking guy at the end. Moving to position. Spirit of fire actual. We have eyes on the banished camp. Here we go. Like, this story legit. I used to hate this style of game back in the day, but I also never really was into mouse and keyboard. See, I was really into this style of game. My friends are all about, like, Command and Conquer and shit. Age of Empires was more my jam. I've honestly probably never watched a single second of Age of Empires. I know there was Command and Conquer, and then there was, like, a medieval version of Command and Conquer. That's Age of Empires. With, like, knights and shit? Yeah. Or, like, axes and shit or some shit? Yeah. I, Bow and arrows, I think there's like another that. one. It doesn't sound like what I'm thinking. I'd have to look it up. World of Warcraft? Local units. Was Warcraft RTS originally? Yeah, originally. That might be the old Warcraft. Warcraft 1, 2, and I think 3 started the MMO. I'm not even so sure of that. But yeah, Age of Empires originally was RTS. I'm pretty sure it's the old Warcraft so I'm thinking of. Age of Empires was after that. Age of Empires would have been like you'd have been in like probably high school at least. Well, I was in high school for all of this shit when I learned about them. Right. Because the people I know that played them are the ones that that uh, got busted for arson with me. Right. Age of Empires. Was that like, was the first time I got on a computer and actually fucked around with AOL. Was that dude's house? Yeah, that would probably been Age of Empires then. Because that I was about to say that was like AOL. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I was saying. First season of South Park, second season of South Park, AOL. But oh, AOL was around way before South Park. Yeah, but I'm saying it was all of that time. AOL and South Park. And... Yeah, whatever. I have no idea technically what they're doing right now. Capturing a point. It's a. Uh, this game takes place post, uh, like, Forerunner nonsense. Uh huh. 
So like, there's all this weird Forerunner shit in this one. The last Halo Wars was really, really old school Halo. It took place before Halo. Before Halo, before like you're fighting the Covenant. Yeah, like it's like a whole group of fucking Spartans and shit. What were you fighting? The the fucking well, it's like the Covenant War. Oh, like the first war. Like it's before. The, it's around the time the flood become a thing. It's, it takes place around then. So they find the flood on some other fucking planet. I thought the Activate flood. Activate light, light bridge. bridge. Oh. Activate light bridge. What is this? Oh, it's just a person. The is deploying heavy forces across the target area. Do, 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 do. Keep an eye opportunities to coordinate fire. Local units. Local units. Local units. Try. I'm not in control of everything right now. There's like stuff like these guys that are just there. Yeah. The yellow ones. Are you fucking motherfucker? That voice sounds really familiar. I like how you're using flamethrowers. That's never been a thing before, is it? Yeah, I was in a. Was in, they use uh, them in five. Uh, I don't know if they're in five, but I'm pretty sure they're in ODST. Oh, uh, where they? Maybe Halo Reach. They I definitely played, have flamethrowers on them. I definitely played Reach. I never played ODST. I take that back. I played a little... They're, they're oh, definitely in the first Halo Wars, too. We played a little ODST whenever Master Chief Collection came out. Die! It, it made me sick. I remember making me really sick. Why should? You don't have anybody selected. I'm running out of people. <laughs> oh, because every time you put a guard garrison, it takes your people. Yeah, I probably don't need a garrison there either. It's probably one of the um, longest objectives, though. We have here. The badge has been collecting supplies. Mm. Collect what you can. We're going to need all the help we can get. Local units. Getting out of here. Local units. That sounds like. Uh. Oh man, what's his name? Albany is moving out. Avius. Man, that the black British dude. I don't know. They're really posh. <laughs> He's a black British dude. They are already going to be posh. That's yeah, done it. It's like the objective is like, go this way, motherfuckers. Who's in takers? Oh, fuck. It's like... I Ibrius Gracie Gracie's Gracie in there. Uh, let's go. Yay! Get back on Google again. Now that'll make this video fun to watch. Takers. I can't even tell what you're doing. Uh, I'm dying, is what I'm doing. I'm pretty sure all my guys just died. I'm not sure if I can get more people now. Iris Alba. Are these my people? Click on it. Oh, my tanks are shooting those people. Fuck. It looks like you have some green to the left and down. <laughs> you oh, these are my guys that I put in the garrison. <laughs> Got some green. Put another one in somewhere. It looks like that's everybody. 
This is getting this is getting scarce. You're definitely not getting the bonus objective on this one. <laughs> yeah. This is going bad. Uh, I'm gonna take a break. Local units. <laughs> 